Hey guys, welcome back to the Planner Pixie Co. Show and welcome to Customs Week. So, um, this is our custom examples video, but I also have a couple of surprises for you guys. So, I've got printers going, I've got my fooling machine going, so I apologize if it's a little bit loud, but I'm actually just still trying to finish up what's going to be the second half of this video. So, I'm going to go ahead and film our custom examples. So, Everything that I'm showing you here today is going to go live Friday at noon Eastern Standard Time. That is September 1st, which um, new month means new freebies, but I dropped the ball and I ordered the journaling cards and our glitter decal a little bit later than I should have. They're not supposed to be here until Friday, so just keep an eye out on all socials, Instagram, in the Facebook group. I may try to film like a reel or something to post to here to YouTube um, but I'll definitely show you guys what all the freebies look like once they come in and I can get it all together my apologies for being a slow poke um, all right let's go ahead and get into what our custom um, customs are gonna look like this week so um, one of my surprises for you guys is that after this weekend customs are gonna stay in the shop permanently I say permanently it's just gonna be kind of a trial run so I get so many at one time that it takes me days hours and hours days and days to do them and I'm hoping that by having them in the shop at all times it'll kind of even itself out and I'll just have like a few a week and it won't be you know near as hard on me um I love that you guys are loving customs from me. I'm so appreciative. Thank you guys so much. I'm not complaining in any way, shape, or form. It's just a lot at one time, and I put, like, everything else on the back burner when I get these. Um, and it just takes me a really long time to do so many at one time. So I'm hoping it kind of balances itself out, so we're just going to try. It's kind of like a trial period. But not only that, my other surprise for you guys is that we're going to have more options other than just scripts and the box overlays um, I've got a couple of what the options are gonna be here from last month and then I'll just tell you guys about what the other ones will be so let's go ahead and get into what your custom scripts are gonna look like um, we do have eight fonts so I did change them some of them again I am just constantly you guys know on the lookout for fonts all the time I'm never like completely satisfied with what I've put together but I just I really really am pretty obsessed with what we have here um, so I did completely take one away so we only have eight and also we will get to have a true like font of the month so I'm gonna continue doing that for you guys but you'll be able to get this font in scripts for the whole month of whatever we're in and then it'll change for the next month instead of it just being you be able to get a font of the month for just a few days so the first one is font number one this one has not changed in a long time this is the OG um, everybody loves this one I used it for a really long time this is font number two I actually changed just this font on it I really love the way that one looks as opposed to what the other one this is a duo font so it works better if you have two or more words this one is font number three. You guys loved this one last time, and I really love this one. This is my favorite right now. I've been using it in my Plan With Me's, and this was a new one last round, and it was the most ordered, so you guys really, really love this one. Um, this is font number four. I actually changed this one out the last... I changed it last month absolutely nobody ordered that font so I was like well okay um, you guys didn't like that one so I changed it to this one I think this one a little bit more cute but also just very nice and neat um, this is font number five it's a pretty popular scripty one font number six this was a new one last round you guys seem to really like it too font number seven um, I actually did change this one yeah this is two new fonts actually so this is a font duo again that works well with two or more words this is font number eight um a pretty scripty one and this is your font of the month for the month of september so i did do another one that i think is going to be really good for um, halloween i did several words here so you can see it in different 
aspects but I think that one's super cute so we'd be able to get this font in, in scripts for the whole month of September and then we'll change it up next month okay let's go ahead and get into the examples of box overlays that I did for you guys last last time so I will say I know a lot of you really love me doing the customs examples because it gives you ideas um, for f ones that you might want or a lot of you just kind of copy and tell me that you want certain ones from the video and I can do that um, it does help me if you let me know sometimes like if it's for a certain um, movie if it's for a certain um, kit I can make it happen um, I guess put the boxes together a little bit better if you let me know exactly what you're wanting so far I've been able to do pretty much what everybody wants um, so let's go ahead and get into some examples that we had last month so um, this one was kind of play on one that we've had a couple of times I think the first one was like it was the year, the month, the weeks, the days, and maybe even the hours that was like an anniversary, but this is a countdown until her 40th birthday. So one year, 12 months, 52 weeks, 365 days till the big uh, 4-0, and then happy birthday to me. Let the countdown begin, and then 39, and uh, forget what kit she said this one was going with, but it was, I think, a Pink Diamond Planner Co., and it was more of like a mermaid or under the sea top kit something or other so i went ahead and put some little starfish in different places um this one says croatia yacht week we are so fun here are sirens call and then living our best damn lives again i was this was uh for a caress press kit and there was a couple um notes that she made like drinks and uh, mermaid scales and such um, this one's actually a repeat of ones that I had in the shop a couple of years ago um, and I guess they had I remember when they ordered this one the last time because I was like well that's wishful thinking but I do I do think the Bulldogs won that year so you're wishful thinking again this year huh um, so each one says touchdown and then she added Georgia Bulldogs go dogs and then 2023 champs um, this one was for a Trolls kit, I, probably the SPC one. Um, now that I am queen, I decree that hug time is all the time. The biggest, loud, loudest, craziest party ever. My name is Lady Glitter Sparkles, seriously. And then I never knew my heart could be so full. Loving you more every day since 8-8-2012. So she asked me to put the eights like this so it was like a infinity <laughs> infinity symbol I thought that was really cute a love so beautiful and divine will be lovers for a lifetime we have something like a miracle and then through the end of time I will stay with you sunshine on my mind fun in the sun some of the best memories are made in flip-flops and there are only 18 summers in childhood how will you make this one count this is another trolls one uh, guys, Mr. Dinkles is really freaking me out. I, I've never watched the, that troll movie. I've seen the first one, but this this one, I think, is like, there's two of them. I've never watched this one. So I had to Google that, but I seen that it was like this little scene here. So I put that in there. Total honesty from a total babe. Um, that's your happy shout. That is a terrible idea that will most likely, most likely blow up in your face. Um... Acadia National Park, Tyler and Natalie, Mr. and Mrs. going to brunch. Oh, this one was cute. This was like, um, I think it was a kit from our shop that was a brunch themed one. And I think the couple that was getting married or it was their anniversary, um, their last name was brunch. So I thought that was really cute. Um, this one, I will say, if you guys could like for real give me quotes but this one was just like somebody asked me to do anything about law and a paralegal i knew nothing to put but i feel like i made it work innocent until i prove you guilty born to argue i object and then i put paralegal a problem solver with the amazing ability to multitask someone who can organize analyze prioritize scrutinize and sympathize all at the same time patience of a saint so whoever ordered that one i hope i hope i did it justice <laughs> Um, this one, Scarlet fourth birthday, Wyatt fifth birthday, Scarlet first day of pre-K, and Wyatt first day of kindergarten. 
Um, this one was made to go with the Caress Press, the murder mystery kit. Um, they were using it for their 30th birthday. So a little party never killed nobody. Rip 20s, um, happy 30th. And then they just wanted me to put like some little clip art elements. This one, I'm pretty sure this one's going with our um, Long Live Cowgirls kit. Check yes or no. Can't you tell this is Austin. I still love you. Cowboy, take me away. And then carrying your love with me. Um, this is for a trip. So 2020 Euro trip with a little airplane. I don't know how to say that. I'm not even going to pretend. Croatia and then straight out of King's Landing. I don't know why I have both of those in there. Um, they wanted football frames, go Saints, no Saints. Um, this one was probably to the SPC full house kit. Oh my Lanta, have mercy, how rude, and you got it, dude. Spending my days catching some rays. If you need me, I'll be under the sun. Cat Papa, and then happy Father's Day. Um, this one was fun, and I really loved the way that this one turned out. So they're going to a Jonas Brothers concert in New York, and they wanted it to be more just concert related rather than like New York related. So New York, New York, and I did a microphone with some little notes. Jonas Daddies, and then I pulled this silhouette here. Yankee Stadium times two. I don't know quite know what that means, but I just did like an audience here, and then five albums one night. I think this is probably my favorite one I did. I was so happy with how that one turned out uh, we love you baby bear the only thing that could tear down the house of the dragon was itself so this is house of dragons I've never watched that show um, you cannot live your life in fear or you will forsake the best parts of it we have always been meant to burn together um, y'all remember the Winnie the Pooh one that I've done a couple of times so I think this is the person that first ordered that um, so Sophia is almost here and with the little bees almost 39 let the celebrations begin and then birthday month never stop exploring so many books so little time I have an angel looking out for me happy heavenly birthday mom I really liked the way this one turned out too so she just pretty much told me that she was a cheer coach and what her um, high school was and that they were called the branch so I did go bears cheer coach bear branch junior high and then the branch <laughs> that one turned out really good too uh, bippity boppity boo have courage and be kind a dream is a wish your heart makes and then four years without my fairy godmother uh, this was another one that they just said it's a anything Paw Patrol. I don't watch Paw Patrol, so I had to Google a bunch of stuff. <laughs> no job is too big, no pup is too small. Paw Patrol is on a roll. These mighty paws uphold the laws, and then I'm ready for a rough, rough rescue. Okay, so this is one of the new ones that's going to be in a separate listing. So all of the different ones that you can get, they're all going to be separate. I'm not going to have them in the same one. So the first one's going to look like this with the four regular size boxes, right? So then you're going to be able to get one that is a tall box and two regular boxes. So hello summer, I've been waiting for you, vitamin C, and then good times and tan lines. And then I had another one that's a tall box and two boxes. Old Shawnee Town, here we come, Ohio River, and then the first bank. Oh, I had three actually, my bad. No, this is four. I've got them out of order. So this was another one that was going with our Long Live Cowgirls. I'm going to love you forever. Ruby, don't take your love to town. I've got friends in low places and then love can build a bridge. And then the other one, this just kind of conspired as I was doing it. I got asked to do um, a quote that was going to go over a double box. So I ended up just doing the quote really big. It's the oldest story in the world. One day you're planning for someday and then quietly without really noticing, someday is today and this is your life. This is one big sticker and it's meant to fit over like if you have, you know, um, a double box scene there, it will fit nicely over. I've seen a lot of people use like one of these and kind of put it in the middle but this if you have a longer quote and you're gonna you know you're gonna use it over a double box scene I can make it bigger and it'll be a lot more like legible then they just wanted a basketball and then I don't want anything other than me so this is kind of the same thing on this one this is one big box for a double box scene but they let me know that this one was going over our um oh what is the name of that kit I can't even think but it is like a big field 
and it has a mountain scene and they wanted Switzerland has my heart to be like in the sky over the mountains and then they said they were doing like flowers and butterflies so I made it to where all of the butterflies were kind of like intertwining and landing on the flowers it looks really good put like on the actual double box scene Budapest Hungary and then the mountains are calling and I must go so this is going to be a separate listing listing where you can get one big box for a double box scene two regular size boxes so that's three different listings for that but you're also going to be able to get a washi overlay custom you're going to be able to get just a single tall box custom like this and then you are going to be able to get a double a big double box custom so I don't I'm not done a whole lot of like quotes on a double box but it can make it to where you have another like big quote that's more legible so I think that's it right Tall box, double box, regular size boxes. Yeah, and then those those two options where it's like a mixture. The, the big one here, two, and then a tall and two. So that is going to be our customs. And like I said, they will be left up in the shop. And uh, we're just going to play it by ear and see how it goes. So let me get into my next surprise for you guys. Actually, did I say this to you guys? I feel like I started saying this and then I didn't. I'll have to rewatch the footage and if I did, I just won't insert this. But um, I know a lot of you like me doing these so uh, you have examples. I do remember saying that. But what I meant to further say was that even though customs will be left up in the shop from now on, I will take what has come through for the month and I will stu do, still do a customs example video at the beginning of the next month so that you guys can get ideas still. So I do have a playlist for all of that and um, you guys can go back and watch them all to get ideas. Alright guys, let's talk paper. I feel like I'm always talking about paper on here. Um, I'm always having a paper crisis, so some of y'all probably already know we have switched our matte paper to a different matte paper, but if you watch my plan with me's, then you know we're going to have to switch back to our previous paper. It just probably will be about a month before we do because we have to wait for it to get here, so momentarily we're using the new paper, which is great paper, and I'm upset that we don't get to continue using it, but our printers are just not vibing with it. We have one printer that actually will print it decently without getting a bunch of paper jams or it being like crooked I don't know it's just like a feeding problem it's not feeding through quite right so instead of having the headache of trying to work with it um I've ordered the old paper but I do have a lot of this new paper um and I was like what can I do with this paper that we can depend on just one printer and still get use out of this paper so Imagine my surprise when I found out that you can actually foil on this matte paper. I was pretty tickled about it, so I've been working on something. And it's something that I want to do monthly, so it's like a kit of the month type situation. And I've never done one of these type of kits. We've never had anything in the shop like this. But without further ado, this is our September foiled kit of the month look how freaking pretty that is <laughs> i'm just so happy with this so um yeah i want to do like a foil kit of the month so we're starting out september 1st which is friday with this one and i feel like one printer can handle just one kit a month right instead of us taking on like all of our weekly orders just on one printer um, it's going to be a headache to do for the next month, but we're just going to have to do it. I feel like just one printer can handle one, just the one kit a month. So we'll still be able to use this paper and I, we have a new product. Like I said, I've never done these kits. I don't think very many shops do pre-foiled kits and I can tell you why. It is a process. So with that being said, I am only going to be offering this in a physical version and I do apologize to all my printable buyers. I know I have a lot of you that are printable buyers but this is freaking hard you guys and I had I've sat for two days and tweaked this file to get it right because you have to run it through two different printers so everything has to line up and I'll be like 
printing one and having to go in and like move stuff and print another one and it's like it I don't know it's really kind of a headache and I really got to like in the groove of it today but like I don't want to offer you guys a printable file that like you have to set and tweak yourself and that you might ne necessarily not even be able to use um, I wouldn't want to do that to you guys but also I run the risk of on Etsy getting bad reviews because of it and they're just too picky these days so I do apologize for that. It will only be in a uh, physical version, but you will not have to worry. Look at that. You will not have to worry about foil for this kit. All of your overlays are completely done for you. We've got some quote overlays. The only thing is if you want underlays and then like your numbers. And we do have sets of these in the uh, sheets of these in the shop too. So you got three different sets. So this one sheet will last you quite a while. And also, um, I'm only going to offer it in the pumpkin hollow. I tried several different colors and I just felt like this one looked the best. Even like the orange glitter or the orange confetti was just too dark for it. And I do feel like y'all take my foil recommendations pretty seriously every week. So I think a lot of you put a lot of trust in me as far as the foil pairing. So um, sometimes we may have like more than one option. We may have two or three that you can pick from. But just starting off, this is just to make it so much as simple as possible for me you guys the pumpkin hollow but I think it just looks stunning so this is an ultimate version but there is one page that's completely changed so we'll get to that in a second but um, this is gonna be a cheaper option for you guys than to buy all of the um, overlay separately because I think you would have had to buy three different sheets of the regular size overlays a washi overlay um, I think that might be it, but then there's so much more stuff that's foiled in here that you wouldn't be getting as an overlay anyway. So let's just go ahead and get into these boxes. Another thing is it's going to allow me to use art that I wouldn't necessarily use. Like I don't think I would have ever picked this art up if it wasn't for this and it's going to let me um, design in a way that I don't normally design. I had a really fun time putting this kit together, but just look how cute. Look how cute this art is. And I, you guys did one. I do suspect this is AI art. I told you guys most of the time I have no idea. But I do suspect that it is. I know you guys just wanted transparency on it. Um, so this little guy's got like some spooky ghosts and a hand coming up and a cross. This is a double box scene. But this whole box here is nothing but foil. Cute. Um, and this guy has some spider webs. She's got a little witch's broom. We've got some bats. This one's just got like little spooky faces around him. And then on the cat, I put just Halloween. I adore this. I think this is so fun. Look at this freaking washi. I just, I can't even. <laughs> so you've got this other little creepy guy and I just put like tree branches coming at him. And then you guys, you're going to have your uh, date covers already foiled for, for uh, already foiled for you like how fun is that so you've got a split washi here this one has your bats that's stunning this one has some spider web overlays so fun all right um here is your solid boxes so i just put some little specks of glitter in some of the corners so it's not too overpowering and you still have room to put your icons your character stickers your scripts and everything but you still got like just a little bling in the corner so i did leave all of the labels blank because i feel like that's a much tighter of a space and i did all of your boxes with a little bit of foil as well as the pattern ones did I say that this is only going to be available in the Ultimate version? I know I have a lot of stipulations for this kit, but y'all, I'm just trying to make it as easy on me as possible. And then also, we don't have like a ton of um, add-ons to it. You've got your headers that are already foiled for you. I feel like I can't even... you see it? So all of your headers are foiled. Um, the only thing I did on this page was foil these because these are header size strips or some people use them as washi strips so all that's foiled for you. I did actually change the um, the font on the Bildu um, wait. as well as the font on the work label. 
Um, here is your just little things. I did nothing to this one because I just feel like they're so small and I didn't really know where to put foil. I didn't want <laughs> to just you to lose space on such a little space. This is like your um, squared boxes. All of the bigger ones have some in the corners. And then look at this sheet, you guys. So you've got two pattern boxes here. I went ahead and put two quilt overlays. So just a little ray of pitch black and then stay spooky. Um, all of your solid boxes have some in the corners as well as these little labels down here have some in the corners. And then here is what was the deco sheet. So some of y'all may be upset about this, but a lot of the art that I will be using either does not have deco at all or has very little deco so i thought i would just go ahead and completely overhaul this sheet but y'all i'm obsessed with this and it kind of makes me just want <laughs> to oust the deco in our regular kits and just use this sheet i think some of y'all be really upset if i did that but um you just have <coughs> excuse me you have so many labels here um the solid ones have it in the corner. I left the pattern ones blank. You have two movie marquees in this one. You've got our regular size flags that have some foil. I did some circles that have foil. And then you guys, look at these. These little post-it notes. How cute is that? So the, the glitter here has a little bit of foil on it as well as like in the corner. These are about the size of these boxes here. So they work much like the squared off boxes. But y'all. I love this and I love this idea and I hope you guys do too so um purchase this kit this weekend and I do have a weekend freebie for you guys so it is a double box look how cute I love this you've got the hand coming up you've got ghosties and bats so this will come already pre-foiled for you like I said it is a freebie with the kit and then I only have two add-ons for you guys so because we're doing the ultimate kit you got plenty of box options in this like you should not want for any labels boxes whatever so the only thing i have for a um add-on is we do have the um checklist which i left unfoiled and then we do have a tall box option will which will also come pre-foiled so you've got some bats up here and then i put a quote on this one it says ghosts and goblins spooks galore scary witches at the door jack-o-lantern smiling bright wishing you a haunted night so how fun is this kit you guys let me know if you like this idea i'm super stoked about it i tried to come up with like a cutesy name for it instead of just september foiled kit i'm not actually going to name these kits because naming kits is hard enough so it'll just be whatever the month is i wanted to do you know because we have like pixie packs and pixie prices I was trying to think of like a cute pixie something or other. I don't know. If y'all have any idea of what we can call this, just let me know. But hopefully you guys like this idea. So like I said, this will only be available in Ultimate. It'll only be available as a physical. It's going to save you money on your foil. Um, what else? There was one more thing. I don't know. I feel like I get on camera and my brain turns to mush. Oh, I was going to tell you guys the kit I was talking about earlier was Flora that went with that box overlay because I just completely, my brain goes just blank when I get on camera. I don't know why. I cannot speak words, but ultimate kit, physical version only. Um, I feel like there's one more thing that I wanted to say about it, but I can't even think, but um September 1st so as this one's leaving the shop another one will come in for October I do feel like that one will probably be a start of a, a Christmas kit I don't know I love this kit so stinking much I hope you guys do too so that's what I have for you this week a new kit of the month and then all of your customs which will be staples in the shop for now um and yeah hopefully you guys like uh what I got for you and uh let me know let me know about this kit. You gonna pick it up? I just love it. I can't stop looking at it. <laughs> I hope you guys like it. So, um, I will uh, put everything up. We'll go live Friday the 1st at noon Eastern Standard Time. If you have a coupon code, I'm not gonna discourage you uh, from using it on anything. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you in the shop on Friday and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys!